Okay. So, let's do it. Yeah, what's All up, right, everybody? Let's see. Okay, so today we're going to be using this book. Uh -huh. It's called Street Talk because mm -hmm. you're interested in learning slang. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because, you know, I learned English all by myself, but it's all from movies or textbook, all in Japan, you know? So I, I don't know what you're talking <laughs> in slang of languages. Of course, not only so. that, but um, the school books never teach you slang. Yeah, 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 correct, yeah, yeah. Correct English, so mm -hmm. uh, we're gonna use this for everybody. And then, uh, yeah, so we're gonna learn some slang today. All right? All right. Okay, so let's start off. Um, do you want to read it? Start off. Want to read what? The the hard stuff. Okay, okay, okay. Right. So the remember? slang one, right? Yes. Okay, so everybody remember this is the, the older stuff. Annie, I yeah, would be both. Annie, Peggy. Yeah, I can I can do both. I can be uh, you can be. Hold on, let me just open that. You can be. You can be Annie, and I'm gonna be Peggy. All right. All right. All right. Right. I'm gonna be Annie, right? Yeah. Okay, I, I, I will explain them because uh, they are all Japanese, so. Yeah, that'll be actually. Okay. Well, you can explain it after. Let's do it native and then after. All right, all right, all right. Now, I'm gonna do a little bit of slang. 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 で、その後にマイケルに教えてもらいましょう。Alright, so, okay, let's start. Okay, you seem really ticked off. What's up? Ah, just get out of my face, would you? Chill out. What's eating you anyway? Sorry, it's just that I blew my final and now my parents are gonna get all bent out of shape. I like totally drew a blank on everything. Well, now you're really going to freak out when I tell you who at Ace it. Good, who ace it? Good, ace <laughs> What's her face? The the one who always kisses up to the teacher? Jennifer Davis? Give me a break. I can't stand her. She's such a dweeb. How could you how could she possibly ace it when she keeps cutting class all the time? She's a teacher's pet. That's why. Besides, he's so laid back, he let her get away with it. She just really rubs me, rubs me the wrong way. And you know what? I think she's got the hots for him. Get too. out of here. I'm dead serious. Yesterday before class starts, she walks up to Mr. Edward's desk and goes, good morning, Jim. Ah, oh, gag me. She's totally gross. All right. All right. Yeah, I understand the, like, the situ situation, the general but... Uh, yeah. The, there are a lot of slangs out there I don't understand. All right, that's it's uh, really, really normal. So we're going to take it step by step. So uh, the first mm -hmm. uh, word is ticked off. Ticked off. Ticked off. Yes, I can Ticked off. Ticked off. Okay, so uh, ticked off is mm -hmm. um, it's extremely, uh, I hate to say the word, but mm -hmm. extremely mm -hmm. popular way to say mm -hmm. to be angry. I'm to be off. angry. Exactly. So you said ticked off, right? Mm -hmm. I am ticked off. She is ticked off. Right? Is, is it close to a pissed off? Exactly. So uh -huh. actually pissed uh -huh. uh, uses it's more of a more street because ticked uh -huh. off you can actually say it in a place and nobody gets upset. But mm -hmm. to say pissed off, uh huh. It's it's a little bit too aggressive in, okay, in a certain okay. form. So okay. like uh, if you're in a business meeting, you like can say they're off. exactly. Uh -huh. You can say the company is ticked off. Oh, okay, okay. But you in a business meeting, you shouldn't say they're pissed they're off. Pissed off. Exactly. <laughs> All right. That I wouldn't say in a uh, um in in a company. I would not use that in a company. All right. So, 皆さん今 ticked off の意味わかりました。ticked off の意味はあの to be angry。あの怒るって意味ですね。普通綺麗なその教科書の英語ではあの angry って習うんですけど get angry とかね。で本当のそのニューヨークのスラングでは ticked off って言うみたいです。ちょっと音が pissed off に似てますけど pissed off の方がちょっと結構激しい感じですね。Alright? Yeah, yeah. So another way you say pissed off in a way to say it is so he said pissed 
off. If you look at the spelling, right? It's, uh -huh, yeah, so you yeah. say he is P O. Oh, P O. Oh, yeah, P and O to say pissed off. Okay. So it's a short way to say it, mm -hmm. and a more politically. It, it's already short, but you know. <laughs> but you can't Make say it pissed more off. <laughs> pissed off sounds like a curse word. It's yeah, 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 yeah. It's yeah. vulgar. Yeah, 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 right? yeah, yeah. Vulgar. It's mm -hmm. very vulgar to say. So since it's vulgar to say, I know I wouldn't recommend people to say. Okay, but okay, you can okay. One hundred percent say po'd. But okay. in the business meeting, I would one hundred percent change it to and ticked say, off. Ticked off. Okay. Yeah, yeah, ticked off. So no pissed off. Do you know? Ah, 結構まあ激しくてそのアメリカでもなんなんていうんですかね。まあ結構悪い言葉なんで、あんまりちょっと言うのもちょっと。えー、まあ場をわきまえないといけないということで P O D P O D P O D っていう時もあるみたいです。で、えっとまあ普通に使うんだったら ticked off の方が使いやすいということですね。Okay. All right, so, All right. Let's, so let's go to、yeah. what's up. Actually, what's up? I want、uh -huh. I, I um. It's a common phrase that everybody uses, but in my experience in Japan,、uh -huh. uh, most people don't know what to respond. Uh huh. Yeah, right, yeah, 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 you, yeah. You have to realize what's up and o g e n k i desu ka、uh -huh. is the、That's、closest, it, right? right? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. But really, what's up is like konnichiwa. But if yeah, someone yeah, yeah, would yeah. say konnichiwa, konbanwa, right? To you,、mm -hmm. what do you、mm -hmm. usually respond?、Mm -hmm. Like、uh, just、uh, kon konnichiwa. Exactly. You would, so、right? a lot of people, when I say、uh -huh. hey, what's up,、uh -huh. they reply hey, what's up, yeah, which yeah. is fine. Yeah. But hey, what's up is more of a hey. How are you doing, right?、Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. You can respond with a, "I'm good, I'm yeah, fine. Yeah, 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 yeah.、Uh, my day is going bad, mm -hmm, blah, mm -hmm, blah." So,、mm -hmm. my my、uh, interpretation more is usually in Japan, people are reluctant, don't really、mm -hmm, say their、mm -hmm, feeling or opinion,、mm -hmm. right? Especially at work or anywhere else.、Mm -hmm. So they don't really know what to say to what's、mm -hmm. up. But you can gladly say, "Hey, I'm good. What's up with you?" Or、uh -huh. "I'm I'm not doing good." But、mm -hmm. it's it's really different because of culture, really more than anything. Yeah,、else. I know, I know, I know. So I I will want to tell them that when you respond to what's up, it's more、uh -huh. like a personal. I'm doing good, right? And then to add to that,、uh, something that I noticed that most、uh -huh. of my students don't do is they don't ask me. Okay, okay, so okay. So you're like, hey, what's up? I'm good. I,、uh, so I mean, what do you think? You, what, what is the best way to respond to the what's up? Your personal feeling. I'm doing good.、Okay. I'm tired. I'm hungry. So、How、mostly people、um, respond like, doing good or yeah, I'm good. I, I'm good. I'm, I'm, if you're like a Monday, right? Like yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't, yeah, yeah, don't want to、yeah. be at work, right?、Mm -hmm. uh, what's up? I'm、um, I'm all right or whatever. Like you can respond to anything, but the the Point is to respond your actual feeling,、uh -huh. okay, not okay. like a robot. I'm、yeah. good. <laughs> you know, I'm good. How are you? you That, that's what we learn in school, right? And I try、so. to teach my students: don't say that. You can if、mm -hmm. you don't really want to talk, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. but in a regular point, you don't、yeah. use. You don't say that. People see you like、uh, you don't want to talk, like you know,、uh, by saying exactly. So like you know,、good. there's、mm -hmm. open and when. When you talk, there's you know we say open-ended、uh, conversation. Sorry, my open-ended conversation, right?、Uh, conversation. Then there's closed-ended、mm -hmm. conversation. So the example of that is, hey, how are you?、Yeah. Right? Open-ended is, hey, how are you?、Mm -hmm. And response is, I'm doing good. How about you? Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, a yeah. closed-ended is, hey, how are you? I'm fine. <laughs> But a lot of people do that, and it's not because they don't want to talk. It's because they don't know what to say or yeah, how, yeah, yeah. how to respond.、Mm -hmm. So I usually、mm -hmm. tell them, say your personal、uh -huh. a, a feeling, your personal opinion、mm -hmm. is the best way to do it. Okay, so, 皆さん今えっとマイケルが教えてくれたことえっと分かった人いますかね。え今ですね、What's up のあの返し方について今習ってました。その What's up って挨拶の時に使いますけど。えー、結構その返すのが難しい、えー、ことあるじゃないですか日本人だとね「What's up?」って言われてなんて返したらいいかわからないでそこで、まああのー、よくあるのは、まあ、テキストブックっていうか教科書とかでこう習うのは「えーまあ、to good」とかね、えー、言うんですけどそれだと何がいけないかっていうとそこでこう会話が終わっちゃうんですよね
だから相手にこう返さないといけない普通だったらそのえっと自分の気持ちをこう伝えてまあ今日はあのえ疲れてるとかまあなんかあの最近ちょっと落ち込んでるとかまあ自分の気持ちを伝えた上であなたはどうってこう返さないと会話につながらないですよねっていう話を今ししてましたなので皆さんも「WhatsApp」で聞かれた時にはなんか「グッとかで終わらせるんじゃなくて自分の今の気持ちを、まあ、伝えた上でさらに相手にこう聞き返せるといいよねっていう話でした。All right, so another, let's okay. Another thing that's really、mm-hmm. that they say in the book is that, like, what's up? It was casual, right?、Mm-hmm. It's a casual way,、mm-hmm. but honestly, I've been in business situations, <coughs> people say it, so、uh-huh. it, it's one of those things that used to be slang that、uh-huh. is, is growing into an everyday kind、uh, of culture. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah, like, yeah, in a, yeah, yeah, in a yeah, professional yeah. business、mm-hmm. meeting. Um, they won't say, hey, what's up, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But when you walk in the door at work,、uh-huh. you'll be like, hey, what's up?、Uh-huh. Right? I'm from New York, so we say, yo, what's up? You know, it's like a yo thing. And uh-huh. Every, uh-huh. every culture has a different entrance,、uh-huh. but it's really crossing over to、uh-huh. a business atmosphere more than people think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I know, what's up? t h e r e like a slang thing. にまあ、聞こえますよねけど今、まあ、ちょっと事情をね本場の<笑>本場のマイケルが言ってるからね<笑>事情を聞いたらあのビジネスのね場面でももうすごい「What's up」ってもともとスラング出身の、まあ、言葉だけどもどんどんどんどんその、まあ、日常で使われるようになってきてもう全然ビジネスの場でも,、えー、もうかすごいかしこまったねミーティングとかじゃない限りはその会社の中でね誰かと話すとかね全然普通にね「What's up」とか使うみたいなんで。えー、皆さんもね、ぜひね、使ってみてください。Okay. All right. Cool. All right. So, the next one. Get out of my face.、Right、get out of my face. Get out of my face. All right. It's, so, it's like a get out of here. It's okay. A, so, it's, here's it's the you're kidding with... or something like that. Okay.、No? So, you, you can use it both ways. So, the,、uh-huh. first, you know, the first way is the, the synonym is like get lost, right?、Mm-hmm. Leave、mm-hmm. me alone.、Mm-hmm. And you have to realize. Exactly how you say the first way mm-hmm, mm-hmm. is if you're very friendly,、mm-hmm. like, ah, get out of my face, like it's playful, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But depending on the situation、mm-hmm. and where you are, it's extremely offensive. Oh, really? So, like, if you, I would never say it in business,、uh-huh. right? Unless、uh-huh. you want to show、uh-huh. that you're incredibly angry. To、uh-huh. so、your friends, it's completely okay. But if you're in the street in New York and you tell someone, hey, get out of my face, you're fighting. Oh, okay, okay. I okay. mean, there's no. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know, yeah. You know what I'm saying? There's no way around that. You're definitely, you know, you're definitely fighting some, you know?、Mm-hmm, it's mm-hmm, definitely, mm-hmm, definitely. So、mm-hmm. you can definitely use it with your friends, right? Get out of my face.、Uh-huh. Right? Get out of my face.、Um, you can definitely use it like that. But if you use it in. In some kind of places, you're, you're fighting somebody. So it's very、okay. offensive depending、uh-huh. on how you.、Uh-huh. You know what I'm saying? Very, very. So I would be cautious the way that you use that. Okay, so in this situation, she said,、uh, just、friend. leave me alone. Yeah, leave me alone.、Uh-huh. Because it's her friend. Ah,、uh, okay, okay, But okay, if, okay. If, like, If you really want to tell someone that you're really angry, you say, get out of、uh-huh. my face, you're, something bad is gonna happen. Yeah, like, you know,、uh, in Japanese, we said, ほっといてみたいな。Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. That's like, so, like, it's so right. It's so,、uh-huh. um, it's so powerful.、Uh-huh. Right? So, you better be careful the way that you use okay, it. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. Now,、um, a synonym to that is get lost.、Mm-hmm. Right? Get lost. Get leave lost. me alone.、Mm-hmm. Right? Now, an antonym to that, that that leads into what a lot of people get confused is. Asobu, like, what are you doing, right? Yeah, I'm yeah, gonna yeah. go play. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. play. So, we don't use that in English because play is actually a sexual connotation, <laughs> right? So, I always tell my students, you,、uh-huh. you don't use that. And、uh-huh. you can look at any like internet、mm-hmm. place,、mm-hmm. and someone says, Oh, I'm gonna go play with my friend,、uh-huh. and uh-huh. all the like foreigners who speak English、uh-huh. are laughing, like,、uh-huh. Oh, you're gonna go yeah, play, yeah. right? <laughs> so, the, the real correct word that you know is hang, out, hang out, right?、Uh-huh. Let's. Let's hang, hang out. out. It's okay, completely okay. opposite, right?、Mm-hmm. And it says, Why don't you hang out with me? Or、mm-hmm. let's go hang out.、Mm-hmm. We don't say, Let's go play. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The yeah. only time you say, Let's go play is when you play a sport. Uh huh. That's yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. I'm trying to think of, or let's play like you're going to play an instrument. Mm-hmm. But you don't say asobu for、mm-hmm. play because、uh-huh. it's the, the connotation is completely off. And I、uh-huh. hear it all the time. And I see it on the internet every day.、Oh. So I would always tell my, my students please avoid that because、uh-huh. 
I I know plenty of people who've been confused the first uh -huh. time they hear it. So it's like, oh, she wants to play it. No, 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 no. Okay. All right. So, ima yutte dano wa play ano asobutte asobutte kotoba yoku tsukau to omon desu kedo asobi koyo to kane, kondo asobo yo to kane. So, no toki ni yappai shiranai to play ってことばを使いがちなんですよね。この play っていうのは、まあ基本的には楽器を弾くとかスポーツをねするとかの play なんですけども、その遊ぶっていう意味で play を使ってしまうとちょっとなんかこうセクシャルな<笑>意味にこうなってしまうので、もし間違って使ってしまった時にはちょっとあの。変な顔されるっていうか、まあ、そんな感じになるから、えっと、その普通に遊ぼうよって意味で使うときには、hang out を使ってください。Yeah. Okay. So, just to another thing that just to piggyback off that is、mm -hmm. relax. The word、oh, relax. You... So, a lot of people would use like, hey, what did you,、uh -huh. um, like, what are you doing tonight? And they, they'll say, like, I'm gonna go home、uh -huh. and relax, or、uh, what did you do this weekend? I'll be like, Mm -hmm. uh, uh, they'll say, like, I was home and I relaxed, right?、Uh -huh. Honestly, it's fine, but it's overly used in Japan.、Uh -huh. You would use the word, I stayed home and hung yeah, out. Yeah, 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 I yeah, yeah. hung out at home. Hung out at home equals relaxed. Oh, really? It,、yeah. It's like a ch chill out. Exactly.、Uh -huh. That's going to lead to the next one. So, like,、uh -huh. I chilled out at home. I hung、mm -hmm. out at home equals relaxed. Relax. Okay, okay. Because we don't use, you, you know, you could equal that side, right? Like、mm -hmm. at your own pace. Yeah, yeah,、right? yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it's, it's Japanese English to、mm -hmm, say、mm -hmm. relax so、mm -hmm. many times. You would say hung out or、uh -huh. chilled out or、uh -huh. some, something like that. That's how you would use it. It happens all the time. And I'm trying to correct my students to say that more because, yes, you are relaxing, but、mm -hmm. I've never said relax that many times、mm -hmm. in my life. You know? Okay, 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 we, okay. We usually say, What are you doing this weekend? Oh, I'm, um, I'm uh, hanging out at home.、Uh -huh. Hanging out at home means relax. And the reason is because、uh, most people think、mm -hmm. their house is a safe place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, in the safe、uh -huh. place, you can calm down and、mm -hmm. relax,、mm -hmm. right? Outside is the busy part.、Mm -hmm. So, we don't usually say, Usually, right? Of course, people say it, but nowhere near as much as. You could eat this, you know, I'm、uh, taking it easy. No one、uh -huh, here as much、uh -huh. as Japan. No, no, no. Completely different. All right. So, I'm going to say that 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 I'm going to say No, 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 like,、um, it's weird. Japanese English. Like, make your own pace or? Yeah, yeah, they say that all the time, right? right? At your own pace is actually English, but it's used wrong.、Uh -huh. My students would say, like, I'm like, what did you do this weekend? I stayed home. I could relax. They、oh, always say that. Okay, okay, okay. Like, they'll say, I stayed home.、Uh -huh. I could relax. And you don't use that because. If you say I could uh -huh, uh -huh, relax, uh -huh. you're telling me before you could not. Yeah, yeah, relax, yeah, 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 yeah. Right? So this is how they would translate that.、Uh -huh. And I would say, no, I hung out at home. That's how you would、uh -huh, change、uh -huh. that. That's completely different. But they say that all the time. I could okay, relax. Okay, like, okay. Or like、um, they would say, a refreshed. They refreshed. say that all the time. Ah,、uh, refresh. I could refresh. <laughs>、uh -huh. And、um, I could refresh. And refresh, honestly,、mm -hmm. the only time I use that、mm -hmm. like, is in a commercial. Like, you know, you drink the Coca Cola. Ah, <laughs> refreshing. <laughs> We don't use it like that. It's overly used. We would say,、uh, I hung out.、Uh -huh, right? uh -huh, I hung out at、uh -huh. home. I hung out at home. Or, I hung out with my friends、okay. is combining asobu and、uh -huh. relaxing at、okay. the same time. So, like、uh, Japanese people, like including me,、uh, we use the f r e s h the f r e s h in、English. katakana. But,、uh, like, how do you say,、um, how do you feel after you're taking a shower? Like,、uh, okay, at, so, at the situation, exactly, we, exactly I, the situation we say, the f r e s h is it. So, 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 so. You <laughs> it's so hard because, <laughs> because if, first of all, we don't take baths as much. Ah,、uh, yeah, 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 yeah. I know, so, I know, I know. Um, you say, like, I feel clean, but I I, feel... <laughs>、uh, I'm trying to think the, the, the、um, I'm trying to think of like when、mm -hmm. you would say that, and、mm -hmm. I, 
um, let's say like you went outside and let's say we go to the gym, right? And we yeah, work out really yeah, hard in the yeah. gym yeah. and you take a shower. Yeah. I would just, I would just say like, oh, I feel better. I feel better. That's feel it. Great. Okay, okay, I don't, okay, okay. I don't say like I feel okay. refreshed. English is more it's easy. Different. It's more right? easy. Yeah, more like, easy. I'm like every time. Of course, I could be different. So like, if someone someone could correct me, right? But uh -huh. I've only used refresh like you refresh the screen. You know when you oh, okay, you know, okay, okay, or okay. like in a yeah. Coca Cola commercial yeah. <laughs> or like. Um, like a deodorant commercial. Uh, like, it's refreshing. Refreshing. Yeah, yeah. that's like a Sprite commercial. Uh -huh. I, I personally, it's like an advertisement exactly. word. Exactly. Yeah. Those uh -huh. are like advertising words, not like... That's really Japanese English. Okay, so... It's a lot of interesting things. I was thinking about it あの使う言葉はまあ chill out とか hang out とか使うんですよね。うん、でその時にまあよくえっとあるのが日本語でなんか、えー、refresh という言葉を使う refresh っていう言葉を使うこと、えー、使いがちなんですよね日本人の人がね。で、えー、この refresh っていう言葉は実際の英語では全然使わないんですよ。で確かに僕もあんま使ったことなくて。Of course, some people use it,、oh, yeah, but yeah, yeah. it's overly used. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, like, if you say a hundred, it's like ten percent.、Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah. <笑>なんかそのリフレッシュって確かに使わないこともないんですけど、どういう時に本当は英語で使うかっていうと、まあコカコーラとかのもう宣伝みたいなものなんですよ。リフレッシュするみたいな宣伝文句みたいな感じとか、あとは。えー、リフレッシュするのはそのなんかパソコンのね画面をねもう一回こうリフレッシュするみたいなそういう言い方でしか使わなくてなんかもうじゃあちょっと僕が例え話で言ったんですけどその日本語のリフレッシュとかって使う時とかシャワーをね浴びたりとかした時にあリフレッシュしたみたいな感じの気持ちがするじゃないですかその時英語でもリフレッシュってあんまりやっぱり使わないっぽくてなんかその普通に I feel better とか I feel great とかもうそんな簡単な言い方しかないんですよねリフレッシュって結構独特なカタカナの日本語かなって思います、mm -hmm. Yeah Alright cool Alright now chill out I know you've heard chill out before Yeah 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 chill out I use that all the time Like I think that's like my Yeah yeah yeah, yeah. I, I heard so, a lot of from you Yeah So to chill out、mm -hmm. means calm down Calm down. Yeah, to calm down,、mm -hmm. right? But the way that I usually is like chill, 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 chill. Mm -hmm. Calm down, calm down.、Mm -hmm. Chill, chill, right? We say just chill, right? Just take it easy. Just take it easy, yeah. Yeah, just take it easy, just chill. Now, to go back to hang out,、mm -hmm. what were you doing yesterday?、Mm -hmm. I was chilling. Oh. At home. At home. At home. So that is very, very like. <laughs> I think that's like the most common English <laughs> that people don't relax.、Uh -huh. You know, fire、uh -huh. is hot. It、yeah. can be exciting, it can、yeah. be angry. Yeah. Chill is more slow. Yeah. We don't say ice、mm -hmm. unless that's the new slang, but、mm -hmm. it's not the new slang. Because、mm -hmm. chill is more like you can. If you're ice, d you can't move.、Mm -hmm. But、mm -hmm. chilling is like slow motion. Yeah, 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 yeah. So. To chill, I was chilling at home, I was just chilling, is, it means relax. Okay. What, what was the original meaning of chill? So, you know, I've been using chill <laughs> since like sixth grade. <laughs> okay. Like, I, it's so long ago. Like,、yeah. um, remember, to chill is、uh, chill, like sumetai, right?、Mm -hmm. When you chill、mm -hmm. a drink,、mm -hmm. yeah. you, bring, yeah. you bring down the temperature. But the way that we use it is like take it easy,、um, relaxing.、Uh, you hear like this is more like funny for kids. We'll say take a chill pill because chill and pill、uh -huh. rhyme.、Uh -huh. right? But that's more like kids. Another way that you can link it together is mellow out. Or mellow, mellow out. Yeah, just mellow down. I'd never heard of that yeah, before. You hear, it, you hear that. I think I heard it more when I was younger, but I still、yeah. hear it.、So、oh, really? Yeah, mellow. Like adult people still say yeah, it? Yeah, yeah.、Um, you would use it like、uh, a, a mellowing down. Like if you drink,、mm -hmm. like that feeling that you get, like the,、oh, 
like that. Uh -huh, I'm so uh -huh. relaxed. Uh -huh. You know, it's like ah, oh, you're mellow. Oh, or like you can... melting down. It's mm, not less less to do with that. It's more like if you, uh, if you say like. They used to have a soda called uh, Mellow Yellow. That's oh, okay. Mellow. Okay, okay, okay. So if you want to translate that, but that means mm. mellow. It's, it's really, you know, difficult Japanese. <laughs> <laughs> I can't explain it. <laughs> yeah, but that's what it means to mellow. When, when you can use it to describe uh, a person, how, uh -huh. what kind of person is uh -huh. he? He's a mellow person, like uh -huh. very. He doesn't get excited, mm. very like, we're not mellow mm. people. I'm not yeah, mellow yeah, yeah. we're excited. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's how you would use mellow, and you could say mellow out, chill out, uh, take okay, it easy. Okay, okay, okay. It's the equal. Exactly, mm -hmm. exactly. Right? Don't yeah, be upset. Yeah. Um, now, we're gonna do the opposite of that. Opposite. Is freak out. Right? Okay, okay, okay. Don't freak out. Out, yeah, freak out. Right? He's freaking out. Like uh, it's uh it's close to the meaning of surprised. Like more of um oh mixing surprise and angry. Yeah. Angry. Right? Um don't freak out. Yeah. Don't yeah. get angry. Uh -huh. But not to come, not to come. Uh-huh. Uh -huh, uh -huh. That's the way that you would use that. Don't freak out or he's freaking out. Okay, or okay, I'm okay. freaking out. Wow, okay, what's wrong? Okay, okay, oh, okay, blah, okay. Blah, 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 whatever, whatever. The train is late or whatever. Mm -hmm. That's the way. And that's also mm -hmm. all of these are like everyday talking. Uh -huh, I'm trying to uh -huh. think of one. I think that's why I confuse people because <laughs> I'm always talking like オッケー。なんかフリークアウトって多分あの僕も使うんですけど、これでちょっと日本語に直すの結構難しくて、なんでかっていうとフリークアウトってただ驚くみたいな意味もあるんだけど、同時に怒ってるみたいなのもあるよ
new tank top T-shirt, okay. and then not tank top T-shirt, tank top shirt. Yeah, okay. Right? Yeah, tank top T-shirt is okay or tank is top. Okay. okay. Yeah, and then you know the there were two the tall black like looks like a model model women's mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and we are uh, and then what was the word? They said just your shirt is dope. Ah, okay. To me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then. Somehow, uh, I was misunderstanding that <laughs> they're like, you know, uh, <laughs> in a wrong way. Yeah, I yeah, understand like it in a wrong way. No, and then, and then I was so... too, I feel like, I, I felt like uh, too embarrassing and I... Too embarrassed. Yeah, too embarrassed. Yeah. yeah. And then I, you know, I ended up throwing that shirt that way. What? And, then, and after that, I talked to my friend about the story and they they taught me the real meaning of dope. dope yeah. It was good. Yeah, it just and means then, good. It means good. You know? It means cool. And then I was That's hilarious. What? <laughs> now we use that all the time. Um that that's dope. Uh that you know slang really really changes. So just looking at our list like chill, right? And just saying dope, I I'll, I'll say like, yo, it's real chill. Mm -hmm. Like you can say a place is real chill mm -hmm. and you can say it's real dope and it means mm -hmm. the same. But chill is more like a slow vibe. Mm -hmm. Be like, oh, how was the restaurant last night? Mm -hmm. I would say, yo, it's real dope. Mm -hmm. Or I would say, oh, it's real chill. Mm -hmm. It means basically the same thing. But even though chill, we were saying relax, right? You can use it the same meaning as dope. It really, really changes from place to place. I can't think of a word right now, but there was, I remember I think I was in like Florida or LA and someone says something and I was like, what does that mean? Mm -hmm. Like the slang was just, I didn't get it. I had to be around from that neighborhood. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So like yeah. the person who asks is extra. I think you can still use extra. I would. I use it all the time. I use it all yeah, the time. Yeah, 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 yeah. So uh, just to jump off what you were saying about embarrassed. Mm -hmm. So you said I was too embarrassed. Uh huh. Uh huh. No, you gotta do the kakuke, right? Uh -huh. I was yeah. Embarrassed. embarrassed. And it's a e. It's a e d. Uh huh. But it's actually a t sound. Embarrassed. Embarrassed. Yeah. So it's a it's a common mistake. It's a you know, that was embarrassing, right? Yes. And I okay. was embarrassed. embarrassed. Okay, yeah, exactly. Okay. I don't. It's 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 one of those really difficult things to teach. Yeah, them. it's it's a uh, you know uh, complicated. I understand it in my brain, mind, right? but um, when I use it, yeah, it's, it's hard. It's hard to you know. Definitely, definitely. definitely. <laughs> All right. So last thing we did was freak out, right? We yeah, freak out. Time. All right. So now this is a difficult concept. To blow. To means blow. to fail. Okay. Okay. So I in let me just get this. To you blew it. So like let's say that you had a test or a job interview mm -hmm. or you had a chance. Oh, it means fail. Yes. So um, means to fail at something, right? So like let's say you had a job interview. I blew the interview. I failed mm -hmm. the interview mm -hmm. or to make a big mistake. Mm -hmm. So like, let's say you got into an argument and you mm -hmm. said, ah, I blew it. Uh -huh. I did something wrong. Uh -huh. I made a mistake. That's how you would use that. It's very, very common. Or, uh, you know, Goofy, right? From Disneyland. Goofy. Yeah. 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 I goofed up. What does it mean? Same. I goofed up. Oh, it. really? Yeah. So goof is very funny because you can say like, he's a goof. Mm -hmm. He's a klutz, you know klutz? I don't know. There you go, today's your day. <laughs> so klutz is a, I don't want to say otaku because in, in English, nerd and otaku in Japanese is different. Yeah, different, right? Yeah. So yeah. can you see it? Here's klutz, this. Okay, okay, okay. So also, he's a klutz, uh -huh. he's a goof. Mm -hmm. That, it means the okay, same. Okay, okay. Right? And then, but you can use it, I goofed up. It's like, I made a mistake. Mm. I, I blew it. I failed. It's uh, the close to um, messed up. Exactly. I messed up. That's, that's actually really common. Nobody knows. I messed up. Mm. Right? Yeah. So goofed up, uh, uh, I blew it, and I messed up all means the same. あ、結構面白いですね。今あの失敗する、失敗するであのよく使うの。People uh, always say I made a mistake, but you know. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we say we fucked up. <laughs> I fucked up. That's what most people know. I fucked up. Slangでは結構この 
何えー、blow to blow、えー、あの blow って吹くって意味ですけどあの失敗するっていう意味で fail と同じ意味で使えますねなので blew up blew up とか今面白かったのは goof グーフも使えるあのディズニーランドのグーフィーのグーフですねこれを使ってグーフドアップとかいうこともできるしメスドアップということもできるとでこの話の前に結構面白かったのがそのスラングの話でスラングって本当にもうもう本当そのスラングって要するにその地域の地域っていうかその小さいソサエティの中の言葉だからもうアメリカでも東と西でも全然違うしその同じ東でも上の方の北の方のひ、えー、とスラングと南の方のスラングでも全然違うしなんならもう全然その年齢とかでも全然違うしあとは地域その住んでる同じ町でも,もうちょっと場所が違うだけでも全然違うスラングがあったりとかっていうのが結構面白いですねなので僕はもう本当にもうどこにも海外の,その海外で留学したとかっていう経験がないからスラング持ってないんですけどあのニューヨークのスラングを学んでいます<笑> Alright, so is this a video? Yeah, I just recorded it Ah, okay, okay, okay Okay, so finish with that? You got it? Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. Okay, so we did blue. Okay, final, you know, final. It's a short way to say final exam. We say, I got finals. But it also、okay. can mean like,、um, like a final game.、Mm-hmm. So it really just depends on the conversation.、Mm-hmm. But all this is like, you know,、um, depending what school you are, we have. Uh, trimesters. Ah, what is the other one called? Usually,、mm-hmm. my school, every school I went to, has three p e r i o d basically. Mm-hmm, right? mm-hmm, three, mm-hmm.、Uh, two and a half, three months. Yeah,、right? yeah. Usually, we start school in September.、Mm-hmm. I, I think you know that, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah school yeah. starts in September, in America, right? Usually. Yeah. Right?、Uh, college starts in like August. Yeah. But college, we have like one month break,、mm-hmm. one month break.、Mm-hmm. So, school is usually from、uh, September to December.、Mm-hmm. We have like a two month break.、Mm-hmm. And then we have、uh, January. To January, March ish, April,、uh-huh. and then we have like an Easter break、uh-huh. or, or whatever they want to call、mm-hmm. it, and then we have until another one till、mm-hmm. summer.、Mm-hmm. So there's three,、uh, we call them trimesters, and、mm-hmm. these three、uh, so mano, bi, and tri. Oh, okay, okay,、right? okay. So at the end of the third semester,、uh-huh. we have a final exam. Okay, okay. And okay. those are called finals、uh-huh. for the most uh-huh. part, uh-huh. right? Um, it depends. In college, you can start different. It really depends. But、yeah. finals usually means because we have like two months off,、mm-hmm, right? Mm-hmm. For, for yeah, 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 yeah. So, those usually the last two weeks of school, you have final exams.、Mm-hmm. It's totally different than the Japanese、mm. system. So, that means finals. Okay, okay. So, that's when, when she says, I blew my final, my final. means I failed the final exam、okay, for that class. Okay, okay. まあ、あのアメリカの、えっと、学校の、えー、なんですかね、システムと日本の学校のシステムが違うんで、なんか、なんとも言えないんですけど。あの、まあ、期末試験みたいなもんですね。あの、最後落ちたらやばい、その試験あるじゃないですか。最終期末試験みたいなやつ。あれを、まあ、英語ではファイナルエグザムと言います。えー、まあ、あとは、えー、あれですね。ファイナルエグザムって言うんですけど、それをショートにしたのがファイナルスですね。はい、ということでした。Okay, now let's look at.、Uh, all right, so it's very, very common. Bent. Bent. Out of shape. Bent out of shape. Okay, so first of all, you know, you have to think of a shape, right?、Um, yeah, and I'm bent, exactly. right? <laughs> so,、um, bent out of shape means it was perfect. Now、uh-huh. it's not perfect. Think of、oh, it as okay, 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 okay. being angry. So,、mm-hmm, when you're perfect,、mm-hmm. you're calm, collective. When you're、mm-hmm. bent out of shape, means、mm-hmm. to get angry. Okay, okay.、Mm-hmm. Okay.、Um, also, let me just make sure that.、Uh, so, my parents are going to get all bent out, of, out shape. of shape to become very angry. Okay. All right. So, now just to add to bent out of shape, a New York slang、mm-hmm. is、uh, to get drunk, we say,、uh, I got bent. 
I got bent. You have to think of it like if you're really drunk, you're like, uh. Hey. Not, like, yeah, 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 yeah. So that's what we say, like, I got bent last night. <laughs> that's like so. That was Friday night. Okay, so is this book from New York City? I would assume it's East Coast, but I think it's both because I, I there's okay, a bunch of Okay, okay, okay. But uh, that's another word to say. Now, mm -hmm. um, I got bent. Mm. Another to uh, bent out of shape is to fly off the handle. To fly off the handle. Have you heard of that before? No. It means to get angry. I flew off. He flew. He flew, flew. off the handle. He flew off the handle. It means he got really angry. Oh, like... Like... Flew off the handle. So you, yeah, so you have to like think. he, you know, he's out of control. Like you know, yeah, off the handle. Uh, you see, it says I asked her what she paid for the dull looking dress, and she flew off the handle. Ah, I mean, uh, okay, okay, okay. So it just means to get really, mm -hmm. really upset. It's really common to say. Okay. Ah, uh, yeah. All right. Let's do one more. Okay, so the last one we're gonna do is to draw, draw a blank. All right, to draw a blank. Okay. Draw a blank. So you see, how it says like, uh, I like totally drew, drew a blank. blank. It means to forget on everything. Mm. So like, you know, if you you have to think of like the cartoons or something when they yeah, ask you a question, yeah, you just yeah, whoop, yeah you forget everything. Yeah. It means to draw a blank. <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. All right, so we're gonna we're gonna stop at that one. Do you want to explain to draw a blank? Yeah, yeah, it's like a uh, uh, the draw a blank. Ah, uh, in これですね。忘れるって意味なんですけど、forget の意味ですね。あのイメージしてほしいのがアニメで draw a blank ってそのまんま訳すと空白を描くって意味になっちゃうんですね。でアニメでこうなんかわなんか物事を忘れた時にここにもう空白のポンポンポンみたいなポンポンポンポンポンみたいなの出るじゃないですか。<笑>あれってその空白をかまあ出てるじゃないですか。なのでそのまんま、えー、draw a blank で物事を何か忘れるっていう意味で結構これ面白いですね。Yeah. So we're gonna stop here because I gotta get ready for the next class. Yeah. Okay. 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 So yeah. I want to thank everybody for watching. いや皆さん本当ありがとうございました。めっちゃ面白かったですね。あの僕もねやっぱりそのなんていうんですかねスラングってやっぱそのえ地域のものだからもう世界とかもう同じアメリカの中でも全然違いますからね。僕もあの外にやっぱり住んだりとかした経験がないので住んだりというかそれ留学とかねあのした経験がないので旅行とかではたくさん行ってますけどもやっぱりねそのね。僕がやっぱり独学で学べるものにはちょっと限界があるんですよね、スラングもね、やっぱね、独学で学ぶってなると映画とか、やっぱその教科書とか、なんかその日本の中で、まあ、せめて会って、人と会って学ぶってぐらいになるので、こうやってみっちりとね、ニューヨーク本場のスラング、ちょっと学んだのはめっちゃ面白かったですね。オッケー、あのマイケルもインスタグラムのページあるので、皆さん、212 English School。Thanks. これで検索してぜ,ぜひねフォローしてみてください、right. めっちゃ面白いスラングとかイリオンズイリイリオムとかめっちゃ学べるんでめっちゃ面白いですよあの特にね本当ねちょっと英語勉強し始めた人とかめっちゃ面白いと思いますぜひあのフォローしてみてくださいね Alright All right, じゃあ今日のレッスン Thank you very much、yeah, yeah, Alright OK Thank you everybody guys Thank you Peace guys Peace out